What's up, people? Monte plays here. And uh, before we start the video, I just want to um, switch up their items because that boss battle, those bows did do. They did. They did jack shit. That's exactly what they did. They did nothing. And I'm just gonna. Okay, she's good. She got the great bow. I just wanted to give her the killer bow. And now we can go. And um, actually, story-wise, where we're supposed to go, we're supposed to go west. But east, there's a couple of special items that we can get that will help us out. They're, one of them is like really awesome. And that thing looks pretty threatening. Let's go within advance. And they can use their... Oh, I need to switch that. So I can select those pretty fast. I don't like I had to, but... That um, light staff should do some damage. Damn, why is it? Why do they always like to crit me? I swear, I'm becoming the new cloud. Though. At least, at least nobody um died in that boss battle because I actually thought that somebody was gonna die, but nobody did. So we're all good. We all get. Even though Dende was like he was at 17 HP if I remember because he got critted. And dang, we took that thing out pretty fast. Dun, 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 dun. And it's hot as shit. It's hot as balls here, man. Like. I had to. I was walking around the house. Never mind. I don't need to tell you guys that. It's a little weird. So let's just say it was hot. It's really hot over here right now. And we're just gonna keep sailing. It's actually pretty far. It's just like a little village by itself, but it's pretty useful. Gosh damn it. And we keep getting random battles. And I should have switched that up. This is post commentation, so it's not like I could actually do it right now. I just think, I just think post commentation, it's a lot easier, it's a lot more chill. Stop hitting me! Damn, what did I do? <clears throat> Sorry. Guys, I got something in my throat. Not nah, like, no homo. No, I'm just fine. But, uh, shit. I'm getting hit like a bitch right now. They're fucking me up. And, um, actually, since I'm only doing one Let's Play, I was thinking about doing a Fire Emblem game. Either from Sword of Seals to Sacred Stones. I was gonna do Fire Emblem 7, you know, Blazing Sword with Ellie Wood and, uh, Ellie Wood, Lana, and Hector. But then I was just like, I still wanna do it, but it's gonna take a lot of time. Since I wanna do Hector Hard Mode, Lynn Hard Mode, and Ellie Wood Hard Mode. And yeah, whoo! It's pretty long. So that's why I'm leaning towards, uh, sorry, leaning towards Sword of Seals because it just seems like it, it'll be more faster. I'm gonna eventually do Fire Emblem 7 because that's like my all-time favorite Fire Emblem game. I haven't played Awakening yet and I want to play Awakening so bad. Oh my gosh, that game just looks so amazing. But people said it's it, people said it's pretty easy. But they're the people who use the overpowered characters like freaking what's that dude? He's a villager and he like he's a boss. That's that's what I know of him. I don't remember his name. I think he wears like a bucket on his head, but I'm not sure. Don't quote me. And damn, one hit, one hit clout? Is that all you doing? Alright, let's just fuck him up real quick. It looks like I'm just selecting shit so fast. But when I like, I don't know. I don't even know, I'm just, I'm just rambling. Yeah, that's what it is, rambling. So, uh... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 300 gil. Oh shit, job level increase and clout leveled up. Good job, good job, bro. It's like always level behind us. Alright, so we are like, we're right by it. We just gotta go about five seconds. One, two, three, four. Oh, we already made it. Alright, so this is the village I was talking about. The town of... Gashau. Oh, they, they make Gashau greens. And sheep. What's up, sheep? Bah, bah. All right, what's up, bro? I can take care of the sheep here. Okay. All right, what the fuck are you doing? No, don't go that way, nigga. Get your ass back here. Fuck you, bitch. All right, so whoever said that herding sheep was easy, they might as well be lemmings. The fuck is a lemming? I guess lemons. I guess he's talking about lemons, guys. And uh, black mage. Hopefully, you got some level four. You got some level four magic. I hope. Yeah, this is. Alright, that, that'll be useful, the Libra, but all the other shit, I don't even fuck with it. And we're gonna, s I wanna sell the Spark Dagger just because I don't think, I don't know anybody else who would use it. Sonic Knuckles can get out there, shell armor, we're gonna keep the Scholar Robe and stuff. And, shit, I, I'm, I'm gonna sell it, I'm gonna sell them. Let's get some paper. 
Alright. So Libra might be is gonna be useful for a couple of boss ahead of us, because I don't think the next boss here actually needs Libra. Because it's pretty obvious what his weakness is. I'm not trying to spoil. But uh let's go. Sorry guys, I'm I'm pretty sick. I've been sick for these past two weeks. I don't know, I usually get over it, but I'm not over it. So I'm just fucking I'm sick. I'm too sick. I'm cold, man. Alright, please please be a healing spring. Oh, fuck you. And there's nothing hidden over there. So let's get out of here. And um that house doesn't even have a door. I mean, yeah, a door. The fuck? The fuck? Okay, what's up, house? What's up, house? A Chaboko farm right here. There's a secret spot in here. Chabocos love gashaw greens. There's a special Chaboko that lives in the Chaboko woods. Try putting a sprig of gashaw greens there. The tree in the middle of the wood. If you're lucky, you may get to meet the boss of the Chabocos. That's what I was talking about, guys. And gashaw greens. Yay. So, yeah, hidden item right there. And, um, you know that, you know that Chaboko forest? If you put a gas out greens, because you remember how they told you to put a special item there? If you put, um, the gas out greens there, I thought it was the Gnomus bread, but if you put the gas out greens, it'll appear. I was just seeing how many times I could say gas out greens in the sentence. Visitors, it's been many years since we have people visit us. Make yourselves at home. Okay. Thank you. Stay away out. These are my greens. are very delicate, you know. Alright, fuck you. And this house. This house is, yep, this is the special shit. There's a secret wall right here. And magic keys open locked doors. I don't think they're useful for right now. But, uh, shit. Let's just go. It's that wall right there. If you go right here, you can't open any locked door. Okay, so let's walk back to him. And we need a magic key for that chest. And I'm just gonna buy 10, just in case we ever need another one. Any, any more lock chest so shuriken okay let me tell you something shuriken is for a, the class called ninja in that class it's it's strong by itself but they have an ability called throw and that ability lets them throw any item or weapon in your inventory if I'm correct and I know we can throw um items like the shuriken and the shuriken is like if if your ninja let me just say if your ninja throws a freaking shuriken, it's it does massive damage like even on the final boss. Cause okay, let me tell you something. When I fought the final boss, uh, I'll, I'll say it anyway. It's like half of a spoiler, but I probably won't make the same classes again. When I fought the final boss, I Monte and Cloud they were both ninjas and they were just chucking. They were just chucking um shurikens at that fucking final boss because i think i think at like before the final boss you can buy shurikens and i think they cost a lot but they're worth it and yay level ups but oh my gosh that just makes the final boss so much easier i was switching i switched classes like freaking a whole bunch in the next world i don't think i don't know if i'll do it on here but i know i did last time and i probably should have slept at the end but it doesn't matter and Finally, we can go westward to the plot place that we were supposed to go to. And, oh my gosh, these little things are so annoying. Okay, white staff. I'm just going to target them separately so I can kill them because I don't think the last turn I killed them. Because I think the light staff can one-shot them and it takes two um, advanced to kill one of those little anets or whatever their name was. Alright, bitch, stop hitting me. You don't know me. Oh, why well, you got a crit cloud, though? Alright, die, bitch. And that one's gone. See, the white mage becomes so much useful when you get staffs. And advance time. I swear, the combos I'll be hitting, though. It's crazy. Dun, 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 dun. And 300 gil. And 300 EXP, that's nice, that's nice. Getting that money up, getting that money up, getting that EXP up. Alright, so, let's try not to get into any more random battles until we get to the final boss. Hopefully, I can finish this Let's Play up. It's kind of long, and I want to I wanna do a couple of the extra stuff. But uh, I want to finish it up by the end of October. 
I mean, not, whoa, well, that's like freaking, like, six days, that's a lot. It's like LP into the max. I want to finish it up by the end of November, hopefully, because, wow, I was playing, like, Platinum until this month, and I started in, like, what, June? Or July? Sometime like that, and I'm like, damn. I, I let's play it so slow. I think I just do it. I'm like super scrimmery. I take fucking year to beat a game. Yeah, that's crazy. And oh, that did like nothing. How do you know magic? How do fish know fire magic? Don't question it. Don't question it, Monte. Why are you only getting two hits though? What's up with you, Cloud? Cause you ain't got your Buster Sword. You can't do shit now, son. Cause you ain't got your Buster Sword. You can't do shit. All right, get your level increase. Maybe you can start doing more combos. It's not like you'll be a warrior for long, though. Wink, wink, wink. Ha, oh my gosh, can we just get there? And, what is that, the sea serpent? Okay, it's not as deadly as the leviathan. Oh, what was that? We guarded the Neptune dragon? Oh, the Neptune dragon. That's what I meant, people. Not the leviathan. I think that's from Final Fantasy 1. Alright, stop stop biting him. He did nothing to deserve that. Nothing. But uh so let's hurry up and get into this um what you call it? Uh the next little cave. It's not a town, but it is a cave. And yes, there are two of them. But, we're worried about this one. So, oh, damn. I don't even know I stood there. And then, as soon as we move, we get into a random battle. And it's okay. It's just like a lizard man and a... Fuck, I think they should be weak to fire. You can burn lizards, right? 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 Burn, bitch! Okay, yes. Oh, motherfucker, you don't know me. Burn, bitch! Okay. Da, 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 da. Okay, so now that we beat those little weaklings, we can head up into this cave, which is the dwarf. I think the dwarf, the dwarf's hollow, the dwarf and hollows. All right. So, uh, what do you got to say, little guy? No, we're little, but we're or we're little, but we're big in trouble. Blahoo, humans, welcome to the dwarf and hollows. All right. Uh, hopefully, they don't all say that. Blahoo. And there's a Moogle, just like they're freaking everywhere. We put a ward on the shrine, no one can get close. We'll defend it to the last horn. Oh, well, we'll defend the last horn. And yep, there's a visible wall that blocks it. So somebody's up here stealing. There's a shiny, okay, shiny tower to the north, some bullshit like that. And um, I think, I think we're supposed to go, we're supposed to talk to the guy who's like right by the shrine and help tell us where we gotta go. But we got we are back and um let's just take a little nice rest at the end to restore all that lost health and magic. Well we've only used like a little bit of magic. But okay, let's restore every fucking thing and become better than we've ever imagined. And uh, oh, I slept like a log. Oh my god, it's being in people store. What you got to say? Let me give you a brief description. Words or experts their events allows them to hit. But they also get hit a, a lot harder. White mages are casters who specialize in restorative magic. They're not physically strong, but their willpower is incomparable. Alright. And black mages are casters who specialize in offensive magic. Despite their appearance, they can take a few hits too. Okay. See, Nami can get beat up a little bit. Just a little bit. And, um, let's buy. I don't know. I don't know if we want to buy anything. We can sell those, because we freaking... You see how much that sure can sell for? 32750 That tells you it's something useful, and don't sell it, people. Just don't sell it. It's not worth it, unless you're not using the ninja class. If you're not using the ninja class, then... If I could sell it, then, I guess. And I don't think there are any hidden items in here. And we get a couple of new weapons, like the Type Ring and the Diamond Bell. But I don't think I'm going to buy anything just yet, because I feel like we get the Type Ring in the next cave so we'll just wait wait it out and um 
Cause you know Final Fantasy always does that. They make you buy some really expensive item and then they'll give you it later and I'm just like, why'd you do that? So I really don't like to buy new weapons unless it's like really, really good. And ice armor. I want to buy the helmet. And no, I don't want to buy anything else. But I really feel like we get the ice armor in the next place too. And um, let's buy. Yeah, we're gonna equip those. And then now we can sell those. We can sell the um, helms back to the dwarf guy. And it's shell, shell, the shell, the shell helm. That's a weird helm. It's called a fucking helmet. Shit. And, um... Okay, so... I think now that we've done all that, we can talk. That part, that little case is... No, I'll say it after this. That rascal Gusto is made off with a horn of ice. He made us get away through the underground lake. We can't go after him because dwarfs can't swim, but you're humans. Humans can swim. You must be... You must aid us in, in, with your amphibious abilities. He's talking about toad people. But uh that cave, that little route to the um right, it's blocked out by like a giant ass boulder. So we can't go there yet. And this is where we gotta go. And if you walk up to it, this message will pop up. In we go. Oh no, are we turning ourselves into toads again? Yeah, you know it bitch. And she doesn't like turning into toads, obviously people. So Let's go ahead and cast Toad on everybody. And walk through this bitch. And now we are in a new place. The subterranean lake. And let's just un take everybody off the toad. And I think we're in an episode like soon. So just wait out. Yeah, I think we're gonna end up soon because oh, I'm about to call it a day. Okay. I knew, I know these guys are weak to, um, ice, but I thought they were weak to fire because it's like, light a bomb on fire and it'll blow up, but my logic wasn't right, and they're weak to ice, like, if you hit them with an ice type move, they'll just freaking crumble, they'll just take so much damage, it's crazy. You see how much they can tank some physical hits, though, they're taking those advances. Yeah. Advance and now uh, I think I think he's gonna be dead. Yep. So it took freaking everybody to hit him. And yeah, I just keep using fire staffs because I don't know that he was weak to ice. He is like fucked up by ice too. And I think we'll finish this lake off next episode, so if you guys can stay tuned, that will be really nice. So you can see me beat some fucking bosses. They're not a boss. And damn, alright, come on, get done up, boy. Alright. So now he's taken care of. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, Monty's job level increased, Dende's increased, Nami's increased. And there we go. Virtue bows. And.